there on the spell cowling my next three and the bug hunt continues with vacuum cleaner Joe Joshua Joe Josh JJ JJ or Triple J as he's known back in college while he was studying artisanal flower street I think it looks all right man I don't know I've thought a person once said that the boss in X3 looked kind of bad but I think as of yet, I really dug their design. Maybe it's because I'm less used to imagining them or something. Also, so well, hello there, giant robot. That man, things do a lot of damage in this game. It's it's fascinating how significantly harder they went out of their way to make this game compared to the other X's. This music's pretty rad. Uh, oh man, we're in the sewage. What did we got as a weapon last time? We got a G well. I hope that you will go well. Oh. Oh. Ah! It absorbed its pieces. That's gross. <laughs> Alright. I respect that. Oh, but oh, we gotta swim around. Oh, okay. So, water's current. Causes current. I've noticed that. I, like, Nintendo is very much aware that they made this game harder than the others, because there's a lot more instances of just, like, these health capsules just kind of chilling. Just kind of, like, everywhere. It's pretty funny. This is small enemies. I'm almost thinking I should use a parasitic bomb. Yeah! Oh, what? I got just died. <laughs> that wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> oh, man, this is so cool. <laughs> what? Why'd you blow up? I guess at some point the, 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 the parasite is just too strong and the body breaks. That's sad. Man, I can't do jumps. Crazy jumps all the way too hard. Hey, wow, that's a that's a hard hard piece to get. Can't believe I found it all on my own. I did it. I did it, Santa Claus. I did it. <laughs> Check it. I'm green. To in order to camouflage myself in this sewer system. Walking down this hallway where nothing. What's up with these rooms? I thought this is where you're fighting Bit and Bite, but I keep going inside these rooms and nothing going. There's another. Ah, I still can't use these. By the time uh, I'm recording this, the muscular beetle video hasn't been up yet. So if anyone had told me how you're supposed to activate these, uh, that's why I still don't know. Uh, it's it's not it's not doing it there. Here, robot, what's you? Okay, you're just a thing. Then your shell goes up. What a wonderful spectacle! Underwater's where we hang out. Yeah, this looks like a kind of a thing. I don't know a bit of a thing. Spikes on the ceiling. I've never seen that in Mega Man game before. Wow. Uh, jump, jump way more than I expected there. Feeling kind of bad. <laughs> but you restart in the water zone, so I guess it's fine. How many lives I got? Ooh. Well. Well. I guess that's just how it goes. I might genuinely, like, game over before getting to the boss or something. It's possible! I mean, not every day can be a swimming day. Let's check out what's above the spikes this time. You know what? Oh, you bump into the, the shells, as I thought. Wait! There's wind! There's underwater wind, the current as it's called. Oh. So, okay. And here it won't let me further. So you have to take the lower path until you have the ability to fight the current, I guess. Alright. That's a weird ability to have, but considering this game, chance I'm too surprised. But thank you for the help, buddy. Appreciate it. Thank you for being around. There, though. Like, oh, oh, wait! You can move! You don't just lazily blop around? Oh, yeah, just big wind turbines. What a weird thing. Oh, I bet there's a thing behind the wall above them, though. That's why you need, you know, fight the current. It's an opportunity to get that to happen. Alright, alright, okay. Makes sense. I understand. I understand the logic behind your decision. I mean, I agree with them particularly. But I understand where you're coming from, and where your desires will drive you astray. Check it out, another mid-boss door, we're gonna actually fight something this time? No, no, my name is... Oh no, it's Mr. Squid. As... Oh man, it's Launch Octopus. Except, no, it is very much a squid. It has mine. So, the tentacles don't seem to actually do anything. They're just there for looks, which disappoints me a little bit. 
because they're like super huge. Wow, really? Like I just shot you like a dozen times. I don't think that's worth the freeze the game and then blow up. You're not an actual boss, you know. Don't step above your station, young Cillipode. Ah, insulting. <laughs> when they're done, we're done with the sewage because the water's drained away. Yeah, this is totally a rethread of uh, the Sea Words adventure of Bubble Clam. Bubble Clam. Bubble Collab. Most powerful video game in the universe can only be played by three people. And unfortunately, I'm not one of them, so you'll have to look around for any LP of that. Hey, I recognize that background from the ladder vips. How you doing? Giant C. Also, Hyper. Hyper V. Uh, except the gameplay here is a lot less stressful. <laughs> Significantly less so. But there's all these spikes on the wall. The you know, ceiling and the roof is the wall, but not the floor, though. And the floor is what I'm talking about. Alright, I got all my life. I got all my health. I have no life. So I got a one shot. Vacuum cleaner Johnny Joy, and if I do so, I'll be a happy little puppy. Look at that guy, although his head is kind of discolored compared to the rest of his body. Alright, so, he jumps, oozes, okay, it bounces. While it oozes, he dances. Dude is way in the dance. I get that. So, does the dribbling of the acid ball something that will hurt me? I'm thinking probably. Because otherwise it wouldn't be there, probably. Oh, oh yeah. Confirmed. <laughs> confirmed twice. Oh, that's that's not good. I, I wish I didn't have to confirm everything with my face. Just because you have a face doesn't need it needs to be a place. Wow, he just chugged that. He's just like snort. That's gross. I want your boogers. If only I had gone there with me one life. I don't know. Who knows about I don't know. What? Is there a wall you can destroy? It seriously looks out of place. Oh what? Now we're fighting? You weren't there the first time. Hey. Hi Bet. How's it going? <laughs> Alright. I respect the fact, yeah, yeah. So apparently there's one of these that I want to fight using the ice weapon. Is it that guy? I have no idea. Man, that's barely usable. Ooh, that does damage. He's doing damage to me too, but... You know what? It's okay. We're enemies. That's kind of expected. You know what? I feel like I'm gonna use my sub-tank. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. I don't know why to that, but I don't want to learn a pattern. I just want to. Whoa, homing sphere that looks like Aghanim's projectile from the Legend of Zelda. I did it. I put ice into you. <laughs> they are too. <laughs> oh no, he said yeah. Sorry about that. I don't want to make you say yeah. I feel bad! I clearly didn't really try to learn his patterns. I'm sorry, I, I just... I, I read somewhere that you want to use ice against one of y'all, and I did. And then he exploded, and I was sad. I, like, apparently it's meaningful to do that, because apparently if you don't kill them with their weakness, like they, um... I'm kind of running out of help. Like, they, uh... Instead of dying, they run away. And apparently that has an impact on something in the game, so I figured it was worth doing. If I'm wrong, so it's not the first time. Don't even Don't even go all the way to the wall. <laughs> You're so weak. I'm just gonna shoot under it as he jumps or something though. I didn't! Like, his pattern is extremely simple. It's just that, you know, acid falls. That's what creates a lot of stuff in this arena to happen. 
Because then at some point, then he just starts, like, rooging them up, and... I'm not exactly sure... Oh, you can destroy him? Why? Okay, wow, yeah, that's... If you're far away enough from him, it's totally worth it. Well, look, I kinda expect to die. He just... he just lobs them! Such a rude boy. I am doing the jump move. Oh, what? That's new. Okay. Wow, that sure was impressive there. <laughs> the most dangerous attack that <laughs> Kothampus knows to make is to just melt in place and then come back at the exact same spot. Oh, wow. No, I'm just... Wow. Yeah, I, it's just, as soon as it gets to the loogie part, I just... I can't react fast enough. Oh, I'm standing behind you. Watch out. This is really awkward. This fight got super awkward out of the nowhere. Wait until he keeps all his colors are back. <laughs> Such a weird fight. Ah oh, shoot! I'm still alive. No! I was I was I I I, I made mistakes. Really low compared to a lot of bosses. I really know when to do. Oh, I thought I could out DPS him or something. Uh, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Like, is that what I should do, basically? Oh, man, it's the, like the abs I don't know. What am I doing? What am I doing? animation for melting down is pretty cool, it just doesn't really make a lot of sense. Yeah, don't don't start playing weird just because he's like almost dead. Just keep doing what you're doing and stay safe so he won't kill you before you have time to do anything. Basic like fighting theory here. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh sometimes. Sometimes it's like never played a video game before. Ah, that was alright. I just, it took me a while to get my head around it. Dude, yo, for a seahorse, dude takes a lot of space. Seahorses are tiny and lovable. Oh boy, I got myself lava lotus! <laughs> Except on, on the Defender engine. You get... You feel blabo. Acid Burst, the most literal name you can give to a weapon. It's kind of funny. 3161. That's what we need to be going down on the lower levels, I guess. That was at the draft factory. Oh, see, it's, no, that's damn. Different things. 